written in 1975, two Viking spacecraft were launched, each of which was programmed to land a robot on the Martian surface. One of its principal objectives was to test for the presence or absence of living organisms. On June 19, 1976, the first Viking arrived in the vicinity of Mars after a year-long journey of more than 400 million miles. Once in orbit, its cameras were turned to a detailed examination of the landing area. Imaging teams on Earth scanned some 800 photographs covering a territory about the size of Texas. The chosen landing site was a fat expanse with a few impact craters, one of the lowest regions on the surface. On July 20th, 1976, flight controllers ordered the lander to separate from the orbiter. Because of Mars' great distance from Earth, the signal traveling at the speed of light, 186,000 miles per second, took 19 minutes to reach the spacecraft. This necessitated a completely automated system on board for carrying out the landing maneuver. During the lander's descent, its instruments analyzed the properties of the thin Martian atmosphere. Good roll attitude hold. Getting close to quarter bar. Far quarter bar. Uh, two loops now. I got it. We have quarter bar. Lander confirm error should be deployed. Three on one, two on two. Do I have a thing? UHF minus 105. Format three is in sync. All right. Format three is in sync. Leg deployed. 4,800 feet, 177 feet per second. Confirm roll, however. Parachute separation. Roger. Minus 105. 23 G's. 2600 feet, 180 feet per second. 20 G's. 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 20 G's